Assalamu alaikum and good afternoon everyone. I'm Iqbal Yusuf. Welcome to TVS New News, August 7th edition. SEDC entered into a memorandum of understanding on property development with the UDA Holdings Wahat earlier today. It is to identify and develop potential land and properties of SEDC as well as to spur greater investment and economic growth in the state. The agreement includes collaboration in research areas, exchange of information and technology, and potential joint ventures in property development management, land management, and leisure industry. The MOU was signed by Acting General Manager Hajah Rakaya Hamdan, accompanied by Edwin Abid, Deputy General Manager, Commercial Sector for SEDC, while the Group Managing Director Dato Ahmad bin Abu Bakar and Group Chief Operating Officer, Business Development and Legacy Norden Murad signed on behalf of UDA Holdings Burhan. The government will investigate recent viral claims on social media that Muslims have joined the Kuala Lumpur Ethics Club. Deputy Minister in the Prime Minister's Department, Dr. Dr. Ashraf Wajdi Dusuki, said a detailed investigation must be conducted and urged the participation of the Malaysian Communications and Multimedia Commission as it involves the faith of Muslims in the country. He told these two reporters after launching the Indra Makota Division Amno Youth Delegates Conference. The government has withdrawn the controversial law reform marriage and divorce amendment bill 2016. The amendments are to ensure that children cannot unilaterally converted by anyone a parent. Minister in the Prime Minister's Department, Dato Sri Azalina Osman Said, informed the Dewan Rayat of the withdrawal before the question and answer session. That's all for me. For more news, go to tvstrot.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Iqbal Yusuf.